I'm Ted Norby, Director of Instruction for the National University Golf Academy. Today I want to talk a little bit about release. A lot's been said about release, a lot's been posted, a lot of questions are always thrown out at, uh, on, on different video sites about what is a good release, what's the proper release. And I think the issue comes in there are different types of releases. And whether you're a beginner, intermediate, a professional, the different there are different releases for different shots. There are different learning curves on what I'm trying to accomplish when I'm releasing the club, whether I'm a beginner, intermediate, professional. Uh, even to the extent where the professionals, most good players to that level, aren't trying to release the club at all through impact. They're trying to hold the club. They don't want it to release. Um, so what I want to talk about are kind of the three stages of release and why we have to go through these three stages to understand what a true release and how to release the club in golf.